spoken and it seems like we are not going to put down this uh, itty bitty well he's not that small but this spider so we'll let him live how's everybody doing today I am Icarus obviously and this is Buck and uh, yeah we're not gonna kill we're not killing the spider so if you're an act if you have arachnophobia you're bummed out about that I do apologize. You do. What are you, you saying, Indigo? I will keep an eye out for trouble. Okay. One of us has to stay alert. So here's a couple things I need to catch you guys up to speed on for those who just specifically watch the Buck Rage Claw series. Um, Buck has gone through some. I wouldn't say changes, but there's been some circumstances in his life that have put him on a direction, a path. And uh, there's an episode that you'll have to watch that I'll link in the um, in the comment section and maybe in the description as well. Um, and then you guys should just watch the beginning part. But uh, basically, um, Bucks. Uh, brother, Savok Rageclaw, gave him an elixir that allowed him to see where he needs to go to help cure him. Damn it. Oh gosh. Yeah, right? Uh, help cure him of his, um, uh, his supernatural disease, as he would call it. So I just assume that all of you guys have watched it, but if you have not, I don't want you guys to be confused. I'm gonna link it. In the description so so yes uh, Buck is uh, he's excited to put this chapter behind him he knows that it's gonna be very extensive in that he's he's probably going to see things and go through things that um, are gonna be terrifying to him but this, there is no way for him to to avoid this so let me see uh, we should have really went in there with pis pistols guns a blazing why do I have this um, okay mm, keep that keep that to sell okay And I do need to remember to put in my, uh, I, I, see it. I was probably filming something and needed the music in. Well, watch out now. Scoot over, you mummified body. So, uh, I now have to kind of process what does the fuck do with this information? Um... Because the location that he saw in the vision was to go to Solitude. So does he go there directly? Um, what I've been told is this content is pretty hard. Buck has no... What are you doing, Buck? He has no powers or abilities. Uh, he's, you know, theoretically one of the weakest characters. Weak, weak in the sense that he doesn't have magic or super strength or anything like that he's you know has his uh senses as a monster hunter um he has alchemy he needs to work on that but i think we're gonna take some contracts and i'm gonna try to get him to like maybe level 25 which just means like three more levels we'll keep telling his story you know he's building his manor it ain't a manor what what is it buck it's a, it's a homestead. Oh gosh, I'm talking to myself now. This is getting bad. Ooh, you okay? 
Which is thunder. This is the thunder. Okay. We're gonna work on our house a little bit, though. Oh, you know what? We can't. We bought the logs, but the logs aren't gonna get here for quite a while. Alright, I think we're gonna go get linen wraps for the drapes. We need straw. We need a bunch of stuff. I really want to build a stable. Super bad. But some people are telling me to get the linen wraps, we need to go into a Nordic tomb. So that is where we will go. We're gonna get some water. My thirst is officially quenched. All right, and uh, oh, Betsy. Betsy. Mom, there, Betsy. Okay. okay. Stop. 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 So we're gonna spend some time and cut this out of the ground. Good job, Buck. Get that out of the ground. These mushrooms just do not belong here. Okay. So that is done. Now we'll head over to where are we heading to? We are going to head over to, what is it called, this, huh, wait a second, did we not get the, oh I goofed, we gotta go back, it's okay, we cleared out the, vamp the vampiric threat. And it's not too far from our silver house. Like I said, we need to level up anyways. The uh, saving grace of this build is really our marksmen. So just us being able to level up our marksmen. I'd like to put new enchants on things. So we'll probably go in with new, new weapons. I don't think Buck's attire to change much. Really like a lot of fit. It's old uniform. Okay. Uh, horse weight there. We're gonna go back in there. Sorry for the uh loop de loop. Oh gosh. <laughs> you hear that? Oh that's right, we gotta keep doing yeah. this quest as well. different shells on okay let's see um head to i have awakened the night of the oh yeah okay so yeah i do want to finish a night of debauchery because that is a very good thing to get So we need to go for that. Head to Mubu Mor Muscar. Where's Muscar? Oh, this is Muscar. Okay. All right, we'll get the ring and then we'll go to Mubu Muscar next. Feeling though that's gonna be pretty hot. So maybe we should get more ammo and uh, you know get potions and all that stuff. So we need to be smart about this. We already took all the poisons off of you. Pretty sure. 
Oh no. Well, well. I am excited about beating Buck, Mr. Mr. Red Claw, into the doldrums of madness. We'll see what happens. It's uh, the other reason I'm excited about it is I, it's content I have not played. So. Ooh. That one's a big end. Okay. So as long as we can keep things at a distance, did that spider just pop? I believe it did. Stealth is really where it's at with this character. poisons because we can do stuff with them. Okay, good. Yeah, we're starting to run out of uh, musket balls. Wow, we're getting a lot of venom. Lots. Which is good. It's good. Buck needs it. Venom will, Venom will be put to use. Uh, this character uses poisons to hunt. Uh, gives him the extra edge he needs. He is a talented alchemist. Uh, not as much as his brother, though. His brother is uh, drawing upon otherworldly knowledge. You know, he's a shaman too, so it's kind of his, his shtick. It's his deal. does have a weight cap too just so you know so it's not, not completely ah! using it oh, that was dead. what we do I would consider this definitely it is adventuresome yes uh, this this falls into the category of monster hunting month or is a uh, buck would call it monster wrangling we done wrangled some monsters all right how much Fro frost venom do we have Wow, we have a lot. I am okay. not feeling at my best. It is a good thing I healed. 
quickly. Are you doing all right? You want to talk? The smell of spiders is strong here. Mm. I hope some are still alive so I can squash them. All right. We are uh, the other thing that uh, helps. Um, Buck is Inigo. He's kind of the only character. Ooh. Whoa! He's kind of the only character that. is with another character the entire time. Okay, we'll take all this. Did we get everything we needed? Maybe it's in there. Okay, none of this, even if I went in the wrong, wrong direction, that was uh, important that we did that because uh, I got a bunch of poisons, leveled up some of my sneak and my archery, come in handy later. Regardless, uh, this was a cavern full of, uh, no, it's right here. Okay, what I was going to say is regardless, we took care of this nest of spiders. So we don't have to worry about that anymore. It's in here. I don't see it. Hmm. This could be a steel. You guys are probably yelling at me right now. It's right there. It's right there. You guys are with me right now. Maybe over here. Oh, it looks like it's saying it's here. This is one of those big. I don't want to fulfill this contract just to get the money. Ah! Okay, that's really weird. Why would it be? Oh, that's gross. Oh, oof. Someone got fed to some baby spiders. Oh no. Well, that's, that's a lot of work we're in. Alright. So now. We will go to um where we went there. We'll go to um Windhelm and we'll make a bunch of uh musket musket balls and 
time is it? It's getting late. It's getting light. Probably should eat supper. Did I say dinner? Dinner, supper. When I say dinner. Buck would say supper. Let's turn off our lantern. Let's run on over to our home. I really do like this home. I like seeing what it's shaping into. Wow, more quarried stone. Perfect. of this. There we go. Let's get as much as we can. Whoa, Inigo. He's up, my friend. But you got my back. Gain smithing levels when we mine. I like that. I, I like if you get a little bit of experience, not a lot, you know, from doing stuff like that, but it makes me, makes it more worth it. Hi, Elga. Okay, so we need clay. We will put some clay. Okay. We'll put keep the bear traps. Uh, put away the firewood. Let's see. We need to go back there. Dump some of that off. Okay. gonna stay here. Is this a garden? I think eventually it will be. Do we have anything to break down? Yes, we do. We don't want to do the, the ring though. Could get us in big trouble. Alright, Anigo. I'm gonna sleep here. Elga, more than welcome to head inside. Let's see. I think you can change the color of the sheets. I thought you could. Ah, it doesn't matter. Alright, we're gonna sleep. Turn off my lantern. And everything, all the shops I think will open up at about 8. So we're gonna sleep in, make sure to get some really good rest. Wake up about 7.52. Maybe 6.52. So if we ride it, ride into town. Okay. Let's go, my friend. Oh, whoa. Did not know this was here. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. When did I make this? Did not know that. Maybe, I don't know. There you go, your bow's over there, even though you use a musket now. Um, let's get out of here. Called old Betsy. A little loud. Alright, we'll uh, cross the, the river. And I think that's the area we need to go to. At least check it out. I think we've actually been here before. Um, and it did not go real well. We were with a group of soldiers. So this is... Maybe not. Let's see. Yeah, this is it, I think. We're gonna take a sniper shot. Missed. Let's see, are you right behind me? We got one. Let's see, I need to wait. 
so maybe we can just snipe them all. I have the high ground. Okay, I don't see anything. They didn't notice that we took out their buddy. Which is very good. Appears to be some necromancers or mages. Okay, I'm saving knows what lurks behind these walls. Oh. Wow, we're just tearing through them. We have some cool perks though working for us. You know that we look I mean look at our our tree tree. Still lots of perks we need to take, but Ooh. There was a time where we just were getting whooped. Maybe we can just go through here. Alright. Let's do this. We got our double pistols. Oh, Fallen. It's a wood elf quality. Need to take that. Might need it. So there is something we need to stay away from in here. And that is it's a giant body of like. Skulls and bones? Yeah, right there. Stay away from that. If you want to know what happens, you have to watch one of the older episodes, but let's just say it's not good. It's not good, and I'm not 100% sure we could beat it. If it did come out, and I need to conserve what ammunition I do have. Oh, stretch, stretch, stretch. <clears throat> in one shot. Let's pick some really good ammo. Maybe some poisons too. Okay. Let's see. Short range. Shotgun shells. Oh, jeez! Very sneaky. This is not how I wanted to do this. There you go. Stay strong, my friend. Okay, don't move. Stay here. Man. Oh, shh. I'm 
maybe shooting a giant uh, grenade at that thing wasn't the best idea. I don't know. I wanted to put it down one shot. Didn't work out. So sue me. Don't sue me, please. Purpose all this stuff for house. Man, someone's getting busy drinking. We'll say that this wine smells familiar to Bob. As he uh, rem reminds him when he went drinking with a uh, certain someone at a tavern. The details are a little sparse. But so you remember something. Okay. Alright, I do need to save. This might cure Buck of his uh Well, Buck doesn't really I mean he drinks, but not a ton. He likes his cigar, so. freaked out right now. I'm not gonna lie. Just a little on. Uh, why is there a portal? I don't want to go in. Alright. Let's face her demons. Guns blazing. Okay. Heart racing. Freak, are we? Okay. For the record, thinking about going to my old rifle. It's just these are like little versions of, of the big one. This is nice. Smells a bit squiffy, though. Hmm. You're here. I was beginning to think you might not make it. It was quite a trip. Where are I we? I thought you might not remember your first trip here. You had a big night. I think you've definitely earned the staff. Staff? We are a collector of staffs, apparently. This is our second Daedric staff artifact. I have all things needed to repair it. Oh, the Hagraven feather and so on. You can throw all those out. You see, I really just needed something to encourage you to oh, go gosh. out into the world and spread merriment. Yes? So all this was just a prank? Why'd you choose me? Let's be honest here. I don't always think my decisions through, but you, you're going places. Maybe a little influence from your old Uncle Sanguine could help adjust your Twins, course. Are these bit. all the same person? Mm -hmm. What are you staring at? I'm just checking things out. Yeah. Until next time. They're all the same. Where are we? Hmm. Just a prank? 
just a prank. The Daedric Lord of Debauchery does not deal in mere pranks. This may have begun as a minor amusement, but it wasn't long before I realized you'd make a more interesting bearer of my not quite holy staff. Okay, we have some. Ha Oops. Maybe a little influ. Thanks, I guess. My pleasure. But I think it's time for you to go. No fun keeping you locked up in here with the staff. Okay. Let's check this staff out. Uh, let's see. Sanguine sphere includes debauchery and passionate robbery. No, we're not. Welcome. Gonna... Well, Let where me know are if we? You want yeah, we're in Windhelm. I think I... Okay, nobody freak out. But we just got a staff. Mug around here. Somewhere. Mind yourself with that part. Burn anything down now. I don't know how Buck feels about this. But I do know that we'll find out that the rose is not behind him. That's so cool. In the next episode. And thank you guys for watching. I will see you all very, very soon.